I was really glad, like, in a selfish way, because it's a big story for Cameron. Um, and, you know, that's about it, really, actually. And then when I read the scripts, it's cool. This is his, it, it, he does it in quite a cool way. Like, as it, you know, it wasn't drawn out. He, he does what he has to do, and he does it, and he's got a few quips in there. So, yeah, I was, I was really excited. Oh, no. Not, not Nico, no. Um, the others, Lockie's not really Ziggy, just Lockie. Um, he's a bit, you know, he's got that tendency to be able to uh, decompartmentalize his killings. Um, but Nico was, she'd been a bad influence on Perry, so he was you know, quite happy to take her out. I'm hoping, like, at last, I won't get any stick for this one. You know, Nico's bad, and Cameron's got rid of her, so surely I'm now a good guy. No, nope. and I say this every time, but he gets worse. He gets worse um, around Christmas time, and the build-up and after Christmas, you get to see full Cameron, full badness. Uh, he loses, he loses it in time, essentially. So yeah, it's, it's getting harder and harder to play, but more fun to play, yeah. There'd be nothing left for him. He would be distraught, I think he would. I mean, if they left him, he would have nothing left. Absolutely nothing left, so it's a case of making sure that doesn't happen. Um, no, no, not anymore, I used to, but now it's like, oh, he's at it again. You know, I, I'm more surprised when he's not. If he's kind of being normal or nice, then I'm a bit like, oh, okay, this is this is a bit odd. You know, what does this mean for him? So the more turmoil in Cameron's life, I've learned to acknowledge that's a good thing. Hopefully, he has a weird way of justifying what he does. But a lot of people hate him. I mean, a lot of people really, really dislike the character, which you have to have because it makes the other people that are meant to be liked and adored, and it, it pumps them up. And it's you know, people love to hate. I think that's what people like with Cameron, they love to hate him. Um, but also maybe quite like him a bit because he's so ruthless. It could keep going on. I don't think there's redemption. I think it's gone too far now. Um, so we'll just have to wait and see until it, when it catches up with him really. Not bothered. One of those things, you know, had to, you know, Joe's in the wrong place at the wrong time. I think that's how Cameron would kind of look at it. Um, I'm blaming kind of Rachel Lescovac for that anyway. That, you know, she's, she's the one to blame. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not taking that one.